What's up guys? We're back here and we are going back and some more Slay the Spire Downfall. Well, Slay the Spire Downfall of Runa. Got a little mix of stuffs. We're gonna go in with the champ today. We're gonna continue this random kind of uh, go. I don't have a preference on where we go and what we do and we're going Runa again. Grab that bucket. Let's get going almost to 10,000 this time. Let's see what we can do here. A fun showing last time with the Hexagos. Much more than I normally do. There is a very aggressive path here. I'm up for it. It's a little spicy tonight. I meant to record yesterday, but as it is the Halloween time, and I had Halloween a Halloween party at work today, I spent most of my night um, preparing a Halloween costume, which I might post a picture on TikTok. I might not. A Ring of Fury. At the start of turn, gain two strength and lose one dex. That's fine. At the start of combat. And at the start of combat, add a random curse to your discard pile. Each time you draw a curse, gain one energy and three temporary HP. Each time you draw a gain three block. Ooh. That says some synergy. All right. We're going to make this a mis misfortune. Misfortune build. Uh, I'm, I'm just gonna get the relic here. Oh, I could remove that curse, but we need uh, at the end of your turn exhaust your hand Yeah, that's kind of gross kind of gross um, the mimic here, but yeah, I was doing Halloween Decorating getting ready kind of stuff just like the stuff you do in one strength here is pretty good Not in my turn either. So let's gain that strength um, Yeah, just doing all that kind of like fun stuff um, have another Halloween. I actually have a Halloween party I'm throwing tomorrow. Um, so I'm going to probably be doing that, but I wanted to get a good bit of recording done here, um, before then, because I can't record tomorrow. Um, I went as Jack Skellington, you know, Pumpkin King, execute here again, a bit more strength, went to defensive mode, doing actually pretty well here. I'm not too upset what we get going on. But it was fun. Um, I actually won a, they did a costume contest per se, where HR got to pick um, people to win stuff, which some of it was like, it was a shirt, a bag, uh, you hire like placing, you won PTO, which is pretty cool. I mean, definitely very interesting. I want to do Punishing Bird here um, for reasons of building a curse deck could be interesting. Um, but I actually won most creative as Jack. Um, two hours of PTO, which is pretty cool. Um, definitely a better reward than I would have thought they would have given. Um, it's broken again. No, I don't think any of those are worth taking currently. Um, so I was preparing that mostly like shaving, making myself uh, very much baby face, which I don't very much like. But at the same time, I was painting on my face. So, shaving, I guess is it wasn't a must per se. However, it did make the most sense um, for what I was doing. And I'm still like, I'm shruffle. Like, I haven't probably shaved in two years. Um, and I, I did not like it. Random buff from random enemy. Lose two HP. Uh, I want stuff that gives me curses. Maybe play a card with ethereal exhausted. This sure random card becomes ethereal. But there's another one where if you exhaust it, no. A random card too. I mean, this is so good though. I haven't taken this card, so let's take it. There's a card against any additional block. No. No. Fetch a finisher from your draw ball. See? None of these are exciting. I don't really understand the, like, the shield ones. Like, I get it, but... I guess it goes to zero, adds fatigue, which is, where well, it doesn't do anything anymore. I think I'll take one uh, perfected strike just for high damage. But like I was saying, I ended up winning that, which was fun. Uh, but I liked, uh, well, I was enjoying listening to people um, guess who I was. Because uh, like I said, I was Jack Skellington. And what I wore was, I have a suit that I pinstriped by hand. Um, a couple of years ago for, for this costume. 
and then I uh, I have a like bat that I made where I just took some cardstock, hot glued it together, put some hot glue for texture, painted it black, added the white stripes in the eyes, and then I did like the creepy like stitch stitching stitched look smile uh, on my face. I shaved, um, but the comments that I got um, went as far as I got Joker. Uh, like three times, which I don't see. I also got, um, someone called me the Monopoly Man, which was just as weird, but overall, uh, for being at work, I was really surprised how many people, you know, adults, because I, I work at a, you know, a adult job, um, how many people actually dressed up. That's what surprised me the most. Um, all of Custom did, uh, which was weird. Control remove a random debuff. Let's try that. Um, can remove the negative decks. But all of our custom department did. Um, you know, HR did. A couple of the other salespeople. It was just cool. It was definitely a unique thing to see. Let this take me twice if we're in Berserk. Berserk. And sure, this turn just ten was all I miss. I'm kind of about this. Any more finishers though to facilitate? Use an attack whenever you play you whenever you play this card game one HP. Got like that. Just do execute. It's kind of the card I'm going for. And then we're gonna do double elites here. But overall it was a fun day. Definitely made me um I, I guess I don't know if laugh's the right word, but it was definitely fun. But that's where I've been, so I wanted to get recording done tonight. And then I'm I'm debating. So I've been watching extra games. Um, I've also been watching a lot of anime um, in my nights. But I've been seeing um, Darkest Dungeon 2 is, I guess, out for testing for some people. Some people have codes because I've been seeing it um, fairly frequently. Um, and then there was Inscription. Looks really cool. I don't know. I, I have seen some of it, so it is a little bit. Um, spoiled to me uh, in that way. Dark again. Um, but it looks super cool. The, the story is awesome. I, I want to see how the, I guess how the full loop of the game kind of goes. Because um, I don't, I want it to be repeatable. If we're playing it, uh, I want that ability. I want the extra block for, uh, I think I want Fragment of the Universe here for the artifacting. Sometimes you play an upgradable card next two times okay so that's some upgrade potential and then i think dual or stance dance so at a combo sure but those are things i was looking at i'm also thinking uh, I've, I've been debating playing oxygen not included and i think what's kind of selling me on doing that is the fact um that they just had an update uh I think a fairly, I think a fairly big one from what I was, I hadn't like read a lot about it. I just seen it on the Steam page when I was looking. I think that might be one of the things I play next. I think I can have, the thing I don't like about Slay the Spire, um, it, which makes me not as excited to play it usually, is the gameplay loops take so long. It's always two hour, a two hour commitment every time we do it between playing it and editing, sometimes longer. Can I introduce this card if you, of a random strike card in your hand to zero. I like the multi attack, four damage times two. We got some strength gain. So I'd like something I could play a hair bit more casually. I just don't know exactly what that's gonna be at. I hate that it's Latia again. She's not the one I wanted to see. All right, let's gain that strength. I'm gonna hit this backliner and we're gonna get poked. And Buckler's already been used up. I honestly don't know what we ended up getting the upgrade on. This is not great. Um, I'm gonna go for the kill. 18, actually I can kill you. Which saves me more damage overall. But those are my thoughts. Um, if you guys have an opinion on, you know, if there's a game you'd prefer to see, um, I'd be temp like tempted to pick it up. Um, preferably, or something I already have. I know we did Don't Starve a little bit. I know, you know, I, I did, I started a Slay the Spire, which might be a good, oh, I did that wrong. Oh, we got Clobber though. That actually works out. Gain additional energy there. Um, I'd be tempted to do 
another either darkest dungeon since it's kind of more relevant now um i'm fairly confident i'm saying 80 percent confident i'm going to do a um damn berserk here oxygen not included at least one playthrough i think it would also be another fun modded game um but i'm not very good at it so i've kind of been like brushing up on playing it i've done like two i think like halfway through runs exhaust pile into your hand don't mind that there's interference though i think i'll wait um but yeah that's kind of my thoughts currently counter counter or add a repost to your hand most of the repost is the amount of counter used deal zero damage does not consume vigor and vigor does more damage you hit someone. I don't think that's or won't. I don't think that's for the build we're building right now. I did consider it though. Alright, we got bomb the bombians here. Bomb children. Crimson Dawn. Uh, I don't have a good way to hurt all of them. The weakness across is good. Give me the berserk. But for that, um I can't kill one yet. So let's Oh, I can't even. I'm close to killing one. Counter. Oh, they're and they exhaust them. Ooh, they want to execute. Is when we want. Berserk here is pretty good, but I don't have a finisher, I don't think. And I have let's a tangible here. And then we're gonna perfect it and kill probably this one. Yep. That's fine. Ow. I think they do ten damage when they explode. Oh, and we're confused used for some weird reason not quite sure on that one overall there's nothing i really want to play here we're exhausting my deck okay um whenever you play a finisher no i need to hit them hit them we're gonna take seven there rapid is 16 which is enough I still well no. I should block here, I think. And then we'll berserk here again. Sure. For rebound. And we get the vigor, I guess. Void dream here, and then we will strike for 13. I'm a little closer. And there we go. I can worry that I'd run out of card before we get through. Um, Express Train to Hell is kind of wall cards uh, into random piles. The two random cards. The two random cards that are yours into. Huh. I'm just going to take the train. I haven't used that in a bit. Red shoes for strength. Hey. Okay. Play twice. We need some block here. So I think I'm gonna do gut punch. Break this key. Get Smith here. Hmm. I think I'll do stance dance. I can feel a little bit more valuable here. Okay. Like that. This is 24. So, get one more here. Get that there's a little bit of healing. Actually, just gonna kill them. We're gonna take five because of it, but overall, I think that's the best move. Focus Berserk. This is 22, and then we'll block here. I don't even need to Void Dream, which I've been pretty happy with. A punch. Ooh. Ow! I don't know why we took damage. Scorch Girl could be good. Six blocks was uh, this card again. Around with a copy of it. I'm fine with that. Um, yeah. Your stuff is pretty. I don't know how this is really gonna go. Red shoes. We are we are in the correct one. We're at a co berserk combo card clobber here. Don't mind that. And him again. Alright, uh, this is artifacting, not thorns. 
weakness here is lovely staying berserk doing five damage yeah. I don't really want to take anything we'll wait we'll have a chance to, to uh, attack them again in a second darkness here strike strike wait about to take three more a gut punch. We need to be in defensive to make use of that, so. Let's do rapid strike. Ow, take the three. Pierce thrust. This. Gut punch. And that's it. I mean, we got a good amount of damage down. We are taking a lot, though. Getting a healing relic here would be very good. Um, da -da -da. Got a ring now. The twin damage. No, I don't think either one of those is what I want. Ooh, Sling of Courage is tempting. Start either Elite Combat with two strength. If not, if not, stun it. Keep stats pretty good. In two strength and two decks, 10 fatigue. Prepare Crush is also very tempting. 81 though. I think overall Sling of Courage is still the best one. It won't have any immediate effects, but um, it'll be very useful during the Elite. And actually the train's about to go off, right? One light. If four lights are lit, after upgrade your cards according to the light lit and distinguish all lights. Okay. Dance, dance. Stay into here. Vicious Mockery. Not the best one. Temporary Strength. Hit the B, block some. Okay. Focus. And I think. Block six, I need to use a card and return it. Okay. Unfortunately, it's going to be a basic strike here, which is not enough to keep us from taking damage. We're actually dead here, right? Now I have to do six. He's doing 14. We're down to two. We're dead. Oh no, down to one now. So any wrong move kills us. I could kill you. Just barely. And then we go and we're dead. <laughs> That's fine. Let's do one more. They're playing a little bit dangerously there. All right, we'll at least repeat again here. All right, what we can do. Choose randomly. Every time. Get the bucket. And we'll leave. Going for quick. Okay. Um, another elite down here, another one. I like this one, I think. Gives us like a late line kind of shop elite kind of thing. We always could duck out if we needed to. I would really like the bonfire, but it's just not a good good path. I'm gonna go execute this time. If that's better or worse. Approach. Honestly, let's add a card. Duel early on could be very good. That's the right one though. Ah, uh, we could do strike build. Could be kind of fun. Let's pick up strike cards. See if that ends up being good or bad. Play twice. So we do this. Play that twice. And we taunt. And we take very little. Okay, 20 damage we need to put on board. And there it is. Right, the universe is pretty good. Perfected strike. That's what we're looking for. Hello, friends. Put him down to one within like one strike range. And eh, do that first. Really perfected is like the card of choice, but I mean yeah. Takes the most damage off the table. Unfortunately being frail did not let lead to a lot of good options. No. Triple strike. Like it knows what I want. I don't want Spire Co. stocks. You can't make me. 
do this. And then I did that wrong. I should have played that first. And yeah, because it's only till the end of the turn. Expected. Let's haunt here. Make a little bit less damage if we can. Okay. Just one damage here. And we'll fragment just for fun. Expected is 24. Yeah, we got this. 24. That. Okay. Your hand, if this card is in your hand, then you turn to five damage yourself. Here, let's try that. I don't think I've really used that card either. Strikes. You can sell potions to the merchant. That's fine. Um, kind of want to go to the shop already. Nine max to remove two. Sure, let's go with this one. Go with two defends. Going mostly aggro here. Execute. Player strikes. It plays it twice. It does not make it free. That's a different one. So it's flurry of strikes first. Then you do double play. Doesn't really matter because I, I I'm gonna kill any of them. Right. Flurry. There we go. Trying to get the combos down. No. There. Um, let's do circumvent here. Replace the uh, defense that we got rid of. This. Two strikes. I'm gonna push through here. I don't know if it'd be worth using the flex potion at all. Circumvent. Good. I think we triple strike to get more strikes in the deck. Which I think fuels perfective strike. I think they just have to be in the I don't have to be in the main deck or just in the deck in general. Um six and twelve and this is sixteen. There's still more damage overall, I think. Okay. Uh, another execute yeah. It's just... Oh, you have to be in a stance for that. Oh, I think that's still the most damage I can do. Forsaken Murderer is actually doing a pretty good amount of damage just to us. Okay. I have random technique to your head. Upgraded technique. No, I don't think it's good enough. We don't have like a build around techniques yet. Ooh, Donor's Washers is just a really good card. I think that's good enough to take. I don't know, Evil Within is also pretty good. Upgraded plus, plus card. Two energy on turn one. I think Evil Within is just going to end up being a little bit more powerful in the fight we're going into here. Okay. Circumvent here. Ow. Artifacting looks different here and I was confused for a second. Um, we can actually triple strike, flurry of strike, 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 strike. And then we get punched in the head very hard. Um, Evil Within is very good here though. Your mind's also very good. All right. Hopefully we can get a big blowout turn. Perfected strike plus the strike, maybe. Ask and you shall receive. Uh, meat lantern. I gotta have some more block here. And I'd be okay with adding another. Deal damage equal to your counter now. Technically, berserk combo is the best, actually. Need a rest here. Um, but I don't think I can consistently get into it. We'll get a random relic. Spinner play card of a different type than the previous. The turn game one block. So we can gain with a block for playing different card types. Makes us want to alternate them.
Um, uh, strike, flurry of strikes. I don't think I'm gonna kill one yet. Take a little bit here. Oh, they went a good card. Getting like a uh, something to kill them all in one turn would have been the best. Take a lot of damage this way. Do this. Then we want to. They're just a little bit too beefy. If I do that, I get six. And this one's three vigor. Oh, this is enough to kill this one too. Yeah. Ouch. And a 15. Boop, boop, boop. Uh, I don't think I could take the train. I don't think they changed the anatomy. And I'm playing too many cards. Gambler's Burr is good. Better than artifacting. Flash Strike's pretty good too. Oh, three crazy employees. Hello. Uh, I'm going to do this just for. Looking for something a little bit better than that. Give me that deck of shield next. Alright. Fine. If I can get one of these dead, I think I'm okay. Just deck of shield. Game five block. Twice. Increased block by one. Huh. I wonder if that's permanent. Do that, get one dead. Fragment, I think we're good now. Just with the five block we get naturally, I think we can get through this. And we did. Not what I wanted to add, but we have it now. Take a perfected strike is actually very good. Ooh, get that evil within first. Chrono boost, that's fine. All right, now we should be that up. We don't play a lot of cards, but it's at least passive strength gain. Not bad. I'm gonna hit you with that. I really don't want to take four for no reason. Give us the counter. Give us the one block. Ow. Okay. Execute. Do I want out of this? All right. First. We have strikes, strike, strike. We have six. Play the strike last. Bow's coming in. Undo that. Oh, I should have done. Well, we weren't in defensive. Get into defensive, I guess. Well, taking one. I mean, we've heard him. All I can really say about that. And double strike here. Forsaken Murder might get us at this rate. Ooh, this could... This does it, actually. Flurry of Strikes, Perfected Strike. It was a rough one. Um, one. Yeah. Debating if I wanted to, rem if I wanted to remove that, but I need the block. And a random card containing strike in your hand. Strike of genius. Uh, draw one fewer cards. Uh, I need the energy. If I can play two perfected strikes each turn, I'd be in a better state. And we got back to the normal floor. Okay. I think I'm gonna stay full. Full left, I think. Bunch of question marks. And rest midway through. Yep. Break that key. Smith. Evil within. Is probably the best card in the deck. Uh, yeah, let's upgrade too. Strike. And then perfect. We took the curse blind. Blindness. Ugh. That. I have to see if we can remove it. And blindness is in the first turn. Evil within here. Chrono boost. Upgraded is not the best. 
I can't see the enemy's intent anymore. Oh, wait, we have artifacting. Did this end up mattering? This is also bad for that. For you. Okay, my friend. Red shoes is fine here. Hey. Towel? I'm okay with towel. You're very good. Looters. Execute first. And you're one of them down. You're gonna take ten. Oh, well, five. Which is still a lot. Fragment, strike. Two cards back. Another fragment. That's fine. Alright, so artifacting is eight up. Um, strike, and then two more strikes. We do have a lot of nonsense in our deck. That one kind of hurt. Strike this here. Do it. So we, our draws are not very consistent. Uh, flash strike upgraded is pretty nice. Incentivize it being in defensive. Remove three cards. I don't think I have three cards I want to remove. Honestly, let's just remove the blindness. Yeah. That is I would consider removing Forsaken Murderer because it is doing a lot of damage to us, but both actually very good. Oh, we got sweepers here. We could die here. They do a lot of damage very quickly. If I get a pretty heavy opening turn, triple strike, I can't play it there. 34, I could kill one of them. I could kill this one actually. I think I will. Get out of here. And then we'll block for the rest. Well, most of the rest. And the main reason I killed him is just one of these down. Allows me to be so much more... Um... Aggressive here. Yeah. Because I think getting him down to two and we'll be okay. And we're doing 20 again. Execute here is nice for the block. 12, you will die, so I don't need to block anymore. The point of strength from something. Or what? There's right you're doing 20. You're gonna be a problem. Okay. Red shoes. Honestly, drink this. Sorry. Strike of genius. Oh, it's at the start of your turn. That was not the right move then. I think this still kills you. No, it doesn't. It gets really low, though. 26. We have 25. Oh. We'll be alive just barely. He is dead. I mean, this probably does it. Yep. All of our potions. Uh, da, 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 da. Our storage state. I want to replay six cards shuffle all day. That's fine. I would really was really hoping for some healing, mostly. Oh, let me get some healing right here. Give me a rest. Try to struggle bus all the way through here. Vent. Strike, and then we'll do two defense here. Perfect block. Surprising. Oh, there's red shoe. I do want to play it. only do it for two. Oh. Ow. On the 12. I think this is just death, right? Definitely is. At the same time, I'm, I'm hemorrhaging health so bad. I don't know if I can continue through. Right now, loot trigger trap. Uh. I take the splinters, right? Yeah. Firecrackers. Overkill is dealt to a random enemy. I can do that pretty well. Ooh, that's something to keep in mind. Oh. Oh, this is a not good hand. Very end. Uh, I mean, yeah, we're just dead. We're either dead or just barely not. Just barely not. Then. 
You are mined. Very good. Um, okay. Triple strike here. Okay. And hit you again. Overkill's held over. And then we actually made it out of this. That is very surprising. Uh, skidboard. Choose a car war. Choose a car going to a car. You can move cars in the pile. Huh. That's interesting. I don't think we're going to make it past another fight, but... It's been fun. Yeah, I can't red shoes here. I mean, I played at the very end. Oh, I should have first. Yeah, we're just dead here. Took too much damage overall. <sighs> Champ. Hard, hard character to play. But let's go do it for this episode, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, please hit that like button. Uh, subscribe if you want to see more. Again, uh, feedback for um, options of stuff to play. I'm thinking in my tier, in my brain, um, oxygen not included will be probably the next thing I add um, and do it between this. Um, Rim World's still on the table. I'd be have like a lot of fun picking that back up, trying to do a mod series. Um, Darkest Dungeon, because it seems pretty popular. And then games that are like on my radar that I'd be pretty okay picking up, um, like a new copy of it, would be Inscription. Um, Cult of the Lamb looks really fun. And um, there's another one. I'd have to look it up. But those are like the two I'd be okay picking up currently because they seem pretty fun. Um, let me know your feedback, guys. I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.